Welcome to the first session in this SQL course. This time I'm going to talk about how we can run a very simple query with SQL. For this I prepared some tables here. For example we have the table on employees. If I just open this, see here I have a lot of different information. In particular I have the first name and the last name of my employees. And those two columns I want to extract. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to switch to my query view, to my SQL code, and I start with select. Then I have to tell him what to select. Here he has to select the two columns, first name and last name. Both of them have the big disadvantage. There's actually a space in the names. So whenever I have this, I cannot just type in the names as is, so I cannot just type in select first name. I have to put those into brackets, not the round brackets, but these unrounded ones. And well, I have select first name. I have to tell them where to get this, so which table to get this from. That's the table employees, so from employees. And I close this with a semicolon. That would suffice as is. So I could just save and then switch to the data view. I get the first name. So this part works as well. If I want to be really detailed, I could tell him, well, first names is contained in employees. So I put an employees in front of this. But well, this only gets me the first names. Wanted to have this last names as well. If I want to have more than one of the columns extracted, simply put comma here, then write the same thing again. Employees dot. Take my brackets. I put here last name. That will give me both of those columns. Just save this. Switch to the data view again, and here voila. I get the column first name, the column last name, as I see them in my original table on the employees. Well, that's already everything I wanted to talk about in this first initial session. So I hope you liked it. I'll say goodbye and see you next time.